My name is Tawanda Mo Africa because I believe in African unity. And I came to August House because it's the place to be. The right environment, a residential studio, because yeah, that's one thing I've always wanted and needed in the prime spot location, also surrounded by other artists. I explore ancient futurism with my art. Almost also on a literal basis, I use found material. Uh, I turn trash into treasure, which is like picking up history, twisting up in, it up into a futuristic uh, expression. My work is very diverse, even in, in the style, because I, I believe versatility is also a style. Art is my oxygen. That's how I breathe. If I stop doing art, I die. So I can't live without doing art. I can't live without breathing. I can't live without my oxygen. I can't live without my art. In my art, uh, throughout my style, throughout my artworks, there is that uh, galactic effect. That is the undercurrent that goes through all my art. The black woman is the mother of creation. Mama Africa. So that's the face. This is the head. As you can see, it's the African map. And this is uh, the African child. But in essence, it's humanity, the whole of humanity. Uh, the gene that gave, gave birth to the whole of humanity. So I celebrate African women, African beauty, African origin of humanity, you know? And then I use found material. All of this is found material. Uh, recycling, upcycling, cleaning the environment through my art. I use the dictionary. There is a strange satisfaction I get from tearing uh, up a colonial language. You know, when I tear the dictionary to create these collages. Language is very central to my artistic expression um, because it's the foundation of us understanding science, knowledge, expressing ourselves, uh, and uh, thus far is very undemocratic, so it needs to be democratized by being spelled the way African languages are spelled.